Welcome Lady Jack and Lover Jack fans to this episode of Yak with the Jacks. I am here with assistant men's basketball coach Julian Larry. Welcome Julian. Thank you. Thank you for having me down. <clears throat> so on Wednesday you guys hosted Dawson. It was a tough loss. Yeah. And take the viewers through the game a little bit. Uh, first half um, we were playing strong. We were playing with them. Um, they're really fundamentally sound and so um, patience was the key with them. Mm -hmm. Uh, we played we played pretty well in the first half, and then the second half we let it get away. And yeah, you guys were clicking in the first, and kind of seemed like what, what kind of what happened there. Um, you know, we were clicking for a minute, and then uh, we just lost our groove. Um, yep. We're still struggling right now to try to learn how to play for forty minutes, and that's what we're really trying to concentrate on and really beat tribes because that's what we have to do. Yep. So. And when the tribes game is coming up, though. Right. 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 Is it two weeks? Yes. Two okay. weeks. Yeah. We have we have two more games. We got Concordia and Science um, on Sunday and Monday, so we're trying to get that figured out. Um, trying to get ready and prepare for that, and then um, we'll get ready for Lake Region on Thursday. But really, we're just trying to get better every day. That's yep. what it's about. So agreed. Now talking about the two games this weekend. First Sunday um, at Concordia, Concordia JV, and then Monday at Wapton against NDSCS. What have you guys been working on in practice, and what do you guys need to do in order to, to come out with a win first? You know, against Concordia, but mainly uh, WAP. I think we need to just show some life. I think that's really the big thing. Um, with Concordia, they're big. I think their smallest guy is 6'3", 6 6'4". Six yeah, 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 they're just big. Homegrown dudes. Yeah, just homegrown ogre guys. So <laughs> what we're really trying to do is we need to penetrate their gaps, get into the lane, and um, try to play hard as they can. That's I don't really know what about uh, Monday against... Monday's a big game. You know, Science, they're on a roll right now. They just got done beating Williston at Science. Um, in five overtimes, I That's believe. Right. So they're playing very well. So a matter of us is really trying to slow down their their main their main components, and really just playing for forty minutes. That's what it's really about. Yep. So now, you've always been an assistant coach all your life at the college realm. Yeah, yeah. Now, I know too. The assistant coaching lifestyle is somewhat unglorious, but it's <laughs> it's it's fun. Right. What now? What are some things that you do here? Um, as assistant coach? Some things that I do here, um, I guess behind the scenes, a lot of things is, I mean, from taking the kids where they need to go at times mm -hmm. to watching hours of scouting to recruiting, going, you know, 100 miles down the road yeah. to go watch a kid play. Um, a, lot of, a lot of scouts, a lot of scouting reports. Things of that nature. Now, what about on game day? Do you have anything that your that your special specialty is? Because I know it's you and Coach Lim, and I don't know if one is focused on defense, one's on offense. What what do you do on game days? Uh, me and Coach Lemon, we design a little thing because me and him both like watching a lot of film, and we watch hours of film weekly. So what we do is he'll watch the sets. Okay. And um, I'll try to, and I'll watch the personnel. So okay. when I watch the personnel, I'll know what which person does, their strengths, their weaknesses. And um, we try to get the guys prepared for that. Right, that's a good one-two punch then right there between you and Coach Lemon. Yeah, we try to get it done. We try to get it done. So, hey, you're not excluded from this. We got trivia for you. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Powerade winner. Yeah, all right. Powerade winner. <laughs> now, we're taking this back. All right, all right. We're kind of going a little on the girly side here. The girly side, huh? We're going Disney movies. Oh, okay. <laughs> I, know, I know you got Sean and you got Nyla. Yes. So you, know, you might know some of these being some old Disney movies. All right, all right. Okay. Okay. Well, you only have to get one right. Oh, that's it? Okay, let's go. Okay. Let's go. Number one. <laughs> Name all of the seven dwarfs. <laughs> Sleepy. Got one. There's one. Sneezy. Two. Drowsy. Drowsy? Oh, you're not drowsy. <laughs> that's, a, that's a cough medicine you're effect, right. man. Yeah, yeah. Not a dwarf. We got sleepy, sneezy. Okay. We have uh, happy. Three. Um, bashful. Yep. Four. Um, Three left. Flirty. <laughs> Talking doors, man. <laughs> it's not good for children to learn how to flirt. Um, That's all I got. That's you all don't I got. know anymore? Wait. Sneezy. Sleepy. Bashful. He said happy. Happy. Sad. Uh -uh. <laughs> I'm done. The ones you miss is Doc. Oh, I wouldn't have got him. Dopey. 
Oh, I remember. Dopey. <laughs> and Grumpy. Oh, Grumpy. <laughs> Good. Now, second question. All right. What was the name of the blue fish that helped the dad out in Finding Nemo? Clarice. <laughs> Not even close. <laughs> Sam Snyder, that was way off. Uh, my name, and here's my story. I'm from the reef and I don't eat beef. Played the voice by Ellen. Oh, I know who you're talking about. Um, Blue fish. Little, yeah, like, I know. She's shy. got short-term memory loss. Uh, <laughs> Should be named Julian. It's a, it's it's a human name. It's not like <laughs> Nemo or something like that. Uh, I I kind of gave you the answer. My name, and here's my story. Um, Ruth. <laughs> it rhymes with story. <laughs> Gloria. <laughs> the story in Gloria does not. I rhyme. know, but it's. <laughs> <coughs> I don't know. Sorry, I'm I'm sorry, Jax. Dory. Oh, I would have never got that. My name's Dory, <laughs> and here's my story. All right, I was off. Oh my gosh, you know you might be the first loser. <laughs> yeah, with the Jax. I don't know if you're gonna get this last one. Cause on the, it's one of the most recent store uh, Disney movies. Is this last one? It's probably Frozen. But anyway, let's go ahead. It is Frozen. All right, let's go. What was the name of the snowman? Oh, Olaf! Olaf! Oh, ding, 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 ding. oh man, I was worried for you. I know. Well, Olaf. I was gonna say the first loser on Yak with the Jack. Never be the first loser, okay? And Olaf oh, is my man. Oh my gosh, I was nervous for you, Juju. Nah, it's all right. It's all right. Well, congrats on that. Appreciate it. Good appreciate luck it. this weekend. Thank you. Coach, Thank you very much. coach your dudes to a uh, to dub. Hopefully, we can get it done and bring a uh, victory home. Let's do it. Let's do it. So this weekend, actually, today is Friday. As you can see, I'm starting to wear flannel because it's Flannel Friday. Oh, that's why you have that on. Hashtag Flannel Fridays. I'm going to have to get my flannel on. Okay, because if we live the Lumberjacks lifestyle, we might as well do it. Right? Jack Nation. So today, actually, the hockey team is on the road playing Minot for their last game of the year. They lost to Williston, um, so they're out of the national playoffs. But they got one more game, kind of one last hoorah for the boys. So they played tonight. And then Sunday, the men and women play in Moorhead against Concordia. Game times are at 11 and 1. They changed. Yes. Uh, to 11 and 1 now. And then travel on Monday to play Wapiton at 6 and 8. 6 and 8. And then the last home game, this regular season home game against Lake Region, is on Thursday. Yes. And it's going to be a whiteout. So wear your whites. Show uh, support for your sophomores as their last yep. home game in the woodshed. Um, then, then the women will have one more, but that's regionals. But yeah, but those games are at six and eight. So come out, support and, your Lady Jacks. And actually, you know, we're still not out of the running. And you're not. No, you're not out of the running. So we either. can still have a home game as well. Yeah, but there's. We don't know yet because you well, guys have to win one yet. more game. But for, it's for sure set for the women. Yes. So I didn't want to leave you guys out. Don't think I'm not hating on you. I don't, I don't want you hating on me. I'm not ever. All right. <laughs> so that is it, Lady Jack and Lumberjack fans. There's uh, come out support your Jacks in some of the games, and always remember, <laughs> go Jacks. Finish this. <laughs> hold on, hold on. Professional. My shirt took